Hello everyone, Rich here, back for part 4 of this RMS Empress of Ireland tutorial. Uh, today's focus is the ship's uh, boat deck superstructure, basically the wheelhouse and any deck houses along the top, and also the ship's forecastle deck details, i.e. this section on the front here, uh, and anything else I can think of along the way. Uh, before I do that though, I'm just going to show that I've added doors and windows to all the inside walls of the uh, superstructure, so you can see on the inside there you've got doors and lots of windows. Same on the deck below, doors and lots of windows. So, you know, the usual design, sort of 10, and or, or the sort of thing I've done on here is actually sort of 10 to 15 windows and a couple of doors, sort of breaking tradition, really. But this is, you know, it's, it's basically doors, windows, doors, windows, doors, windows. So, there's nothing really special. And it's the same on the deck below down here uh, on the stern. So, I did start this originally, but then I got bored and gave up with it. But uh, I finished it now, and it uh, doors and windows go all the way around. So, that is. All that crap sorted out the uh, out the way, so we're going to fly down to the front end again, and we're going to start with the ship's wheelhouse. Uh, yeah, so that's what we're going to do. So what we're going to do first, we're going to start from the center of the front wall here, so on, on the top deck. Start from the center and just build a line of blocks around the front of the uh, of the of said deck, and around the edge of the ship's bridge wings, and then stop behind the bridge wings. So we just go around the sides and then into the corner there and then stop. So that's just basically build a wall from the front round to the back of the bridge wings. So that's what we want there. Do the same on the other side. And then we can start the ship's wheelhouse. There we go. So that's both sides done. And it should look something like that. Very, very different to what it was before. He lied. Right, so what we're going to do now is go back to the centre and we're going to add uh, three windows which are two blocks high. So start from the centre, add a window there, and then one that side, and then one that side. So you've got a, a gap between each window like so. And then we add uh, three, or two pillars in between the windows, and then a pillar either side, like so. So there's your windows like that. And then we go up another block on the edge, like so and then we build an overhang across the front, so just build a line of blocks overhanging the front like that, so you've got a, like I say, an overhang like that. Nothing special, but you know, it's it's a thing. And then behind the side pillars now, we just want to add uh, two two blocks back. This is on deck level behind the window, so we'll add two blocks there, and then uh, two blocks, make it th uh, three high, so it's two blocks back, but three high. Same on the other side, go two back, two back, two back like that, just to build it three high. And it should look something like that. And then for the top line, we want to build this so that it's it so that it is eight blocks in total. So the first two blocks are here. These are the overhang blocks, so the top block there and the overhang. Those are the first two blocks. Then we just need to make that eight. So we go those are the first two, and then we go three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Like so, and then down to deck level. One, two, three three like that so basically you've got an archway like so so I do the same on the other side the first two blocks are there so three four five six seven eight like so and then we go down to deck level like so and it should look something like that now I'm just going to pop over to the prototype because I've written this down this next bit but I can't actually read what I've written so <laughs> I'm just going to pop over and see that I do this right so you can see here on the prototype anyway, we've got the overhang and the archway so it's down one and then uh, two back yeah that's what we want so we go two back after that <coughs> excuse me so like I say you build the eight back and then the three down to the deck level and then at the, bo at the bottom we go back so you get the archway here at the back here you go two back like so same on the other side so we go back two and then we build uh, how do we do this? We do down three, sides two, and then we go out six. So we go one, two, three, four, five, six. And then for the side wall, we want 22. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, <gasps> twenty-one, twenty-two. Like so. So that's twenty-two along the side. Do the other side. So it's well, six out. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then 22. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 22, and there we are. And then we just build a line across the back, joining them all together. Like so. So there we are, there's the foundations of our ship's wheelhouse. So what you want to do now is increase this wall uh, to four blocks high. So I shall just use world edit for that. So increase it to four high using quartz. Just set quartz 
so so four high all the way around and it should all look nice and neat when it's done in theory at least down to there and then the last little section just fill in that little gap and there we go <clears throat> there's the walls all increased now before we add the uh, deck along the top we're going to go inside and then from the back wall here of the archway so you've got the front windows there and you've got the back wall of the archway we're just going to build a line of blocks across the across there like so and then we'll add uh, say three windows again on the inside so this this would be the proper wheelhouse here this is the this is the bridge but the wheelhouse would be in here so this is sort of say copying Titanic basically I don't think this is really on the uh, on the real Empress of Ireland because she's only a small ship but you know keep it traditional you know make it look like that so we just do the same build the pillars two blocks high between the windows and it should look something like that and then the deck will sit on the top like so so we just add the deck now or the roof whichever you want to call it and it should all look nice and neat in that section there I don't look too bad and then we just add the deck in the rest of the building as well so it is all uh, unison so we use the fill tool fill wood by two thirty billion whatever and there we go and then I can remove that block down there and there we go there's the ship's wheelhouse sort of done I mean there's still doors and windows to add but we'll worry about them another day <coughs> excuse me so before we finish we're going to go to the back wall and we're going to add a couple of staircases. Now these staircases go uh, sort of inwards, you know, not backwards. They go sort of set heading towards the centre. So if we go, I can't remember how many exactly, but if we go from the back wall, back corner, and go sort of one, two, three, fourth block in, and remove that block there, and build two wood blocks out, <clears throat> and then we get our stair blocks, which uh, never easy to find. There they are. And we use our stair blocks and we build down to deck so from the top of the wheelhouse build down to the deck below like so and uh, do the same the other side so the fourth block in from the edge one two three four remove that block and we add two wood blocks one two and then the stair block so stairs 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 and stairs like so and then we can add the banisters so banisters two up two up two up and then round wood like so and then add supports underneath same with the other one two up two up two up and around back like so and stairs underneath not stairs blocks anyway <clears throat> that's the uh, back wall done and it should look something like that so we can add a bit more detail now to the actual ship's wheelhouse so we can add a few a few windows if you like so i'll add a window on the side there and another one on the side there if you want to you can make it two blocks high so it's like that so I just increase it in height like so without doing too much damage and we've got the side window there like so and there's plenty of uh, looking out business going on so that's that and then we can add sort of doors on the side so I put a, I put a small door here a single door same on the other side access to the wheelhouse and then around the rest of it we can just add sort of windows in various places. I don't know what window design I used on the product. I'm just going to go over and have a look because I can't remember. I think I used uh, oh yeah on the on the product top I used single windows like so. So you got uh, one block high windows, but it's up to you what you want to do. If you want to use two block highs or one block high, it's up to you. So the front windows uh, on the front walls, uh, as you can see, I've just built here are actually two blocks high. So the rest of them around the side will be single windows so I'll add a pair of doors on the side here and then single windows sort of every third block if you like and then another door at the end like so so that is one side of the ship's wheelhouse sort of thing done and I shall just copy paste that to the other side just to save a bit of time so as before it will copy uh, copy flip to the right and then paste and there we go that's the uh, windows done on that side so that's the ship's wheelhouse there will be some more detail to go on later on there's some gubbins that go on the top like uh, air vents 
uh, and other units and things but uh, we'll add them later on <coughs> excuse me so uh, yeah we're not doing too bad so that's the ship's wheelhouse what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna do a quick jump cut while I wor uh, work on the uh, or sort of work out what to do with the next sections and then we'll move on from there so um, back in a moment Right, back again. So what we're going to do now is move on to the next uh, deck house behind the ship's wheelhouse. Uh, so we're going to go to the centre block of the back wall of said deck house, the or wheelhouse rather. So the centre block is back here. I will put a colour block there to make sure that is the centre. We know that no, no, it is the centre anyway. Uh, so we're going to the, the first wood block back, and we're going to count to the eighteenth block back. So. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. And on the 18th block is where we start building. And I'm going to get my red blocks back because that's what I use for a marker. Uh, like so. So I'll put the red block there instead. So that's on the 18th block. So it's basically a 17 block gap. And then what we're going to do is build a wall. 21 wide which is 10 either side so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 that way 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 that way so there we are there's the wall 21 wide and then for the sides we want uh, 3 1 2 3 and then back in 2 1 2 and then the sides are 18 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 so that's one side do the other side we go uh, 3 and then 2 and then 18. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 18. Yeah. I think that's about right. Yeah. And then we j join the two across the back, I think. Uh, yeah. So we just add the two, uh, join the two together across the back. And there we are. There's our foundations. And this deck house uh, is only two blocks high. So it's not really a deck house, it's more of a platform. So. I'll make it two blocks high all the way around. So that's across the front wall and then down the side. Like so, and then across the back. <coughs> Excuse me. And there we go, there's our deck house sort of built upwards and then for the roof or the deck on top we just build the wood decking along the top line of the uh, white section like so so it's, it should look something like that when you're filling it in so I shall stand on this block here and use the fill tool again and fill the deck in and there we go <coughs> excuse me there's the deck added so you've got this sort of fat t fat T sort of shaped deck house which is only two blocks high and then for the stairs or we're going to add a pair of stairs we go to the outside edge uh, where it goes three back and two in in this gap here with the two we just remove the top block uh, actually remove the wood block and the bottom white block as well so basically you just got a gap like that and then we put stairs and stairs down like so and then we can replace that block there with white like that so it looks something like that so I'll explain on the other side so this is what we have so far and then we remove the two white blocks and one wood block and replace with two stair block and a white block there like so so it should look something like that and then for another set of stairs these stairs go down from this deck down to the deck below so the next stairs are uh, four gaps so go from the bottom of the first set of stairs here then we're going to leave a four block gap so one two three four and on the fifth block is where we start building the stairs. So I put the first stair block in going down like so. And I'm not sure how many we actually need, but I think uh, I think it's five block gap, but we'll see. So I put the first stair block in up there. So I put a white block underneath, stairs again, white block underneath, stairs again, white block underneath that, and stairs again. So there we are. there's our stairs going down. So it should look sort of like that, and you can't really see it very well. And then for the banisters either side, of course, we go with two up, uh, basically build all the way up, basically. Uh, just try and build this as best I can. So really, we want white blocks around the edge. So just add white blocks. I'm not doing this very well, as you can tell, but I just put white blocks around the edge, like so, and then the same around this side. So remove all these wood blocks and replace with white. 
So I want five, I think. So put five blocks, one, two, three, four, five along the side. And that should give you enough. Yeah, it gives you enough headroom to get up and down the stairs without clogging your noggin on the top. <clears throat> so we just build these walls down to deck level or the deck below level. Not so anyway, there's a stairwell basically, and it should look <laughs> sort of like that. So, like I say, it's nothing really special, but the uh, the wall around the side here now we build that to two blocks high. So we just build it two blocks high like that, and then we add a slab roof to it. So we use quartz slabs across the top. So one, two, three, one, two, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, like so. So you got a, sh a sort of shed, basically, but it's, you know, it's just does that. It's got a stairwell on it. So I shall do the same on the other side, and I'll try and explain. Well, not explain it, but build it a bit slower, so you can sort of see what I'm doing. So from the first stairs, one, two, three, four block gap, and then on the fifth block we build the first stair block. And I put the white walls in the side first. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, and then one across and then remove the rest of the wood in that space and the same on the other side so one two three four five yeah, that's fine so it's five white blocks on the side of the stairs and then we put the stairs in preferably the right, right way up like so so there's the stairs and then we just add the banisters or basically walls going down to the deck below I think mm, we're getting there, <coughs> and I think that's about right. I think that's that will do fine. Um, put that one there as well. So I'm just uh, tidying up both sides because uh, they're not quite level. Of course, we've got gaps on both sides, and there we go. That is the stairs done. There. So that's the stairs done anyway. So we'll just add the white two block high wall around the edge. And of course the the roof of slabs. And there we go. That's probably the most complex part of this tutorial tutorial there, these staircases, because they really are a pain in the ass to do. Anyway, we've got those done. And uh, they don't look too bad in theory. So what we're going to do now is just add some half windows along the side walls now of this uh, deck house. So remove a few white blocks and replace them with slabs. So you've got a half window. So just do a couple along uh, the side. Like so, so you've got three there and two over here. I'll do the same on the other side. So two this side. And then three behind. There we are. There's our uh, deck house done there. Uh, now there is a bit more detail to go on now. So there's the deck house or platform really that's done. Now we need to add uh, <coughs> a uh, dome sort of thing. So it's going to be. Let's try to think how to do this. It's it's a dome which is seven wide and the sides are eight long and it's two blocks high. So we're going to go say from the front wall we're going to go one two three blocks back and we're going to build this seven wide I think so center block and then three that way actually build it five wide like so and then put white stairs either side so if we get our quartz stairs I'll we'll put quartz stairs at that end and that end so it makes it seven wide and then make it too high with extra stairs so you're basically building a pyramid like so so you've got a pyramid sort of thing like that like so so it's seven wide and then five wide at the top because you got the stairs and then we're going to build this eight long so that's one two three four five six seven eight in width same the other side two three four five six seven eight and then across the bottom we add the top row of stairs and it should look something like that. So I just build uh, the uh, top part. Uh, you can add glass to this roof if you want to, but I'm just building it as, as a white dome because <coughs> I can't be bothered to do any detailing with it. And then we can add the stairs there and the stairs there. So we are. That's that dome done there. Nothing really special, but uh, 
you know that's how it should be <coughs> excuse me all right i'm going to check my notes and work on what we'll work out what to do next so bear with me all right so what we're going to do now is go to the back wall now of this said deck house or platform whichever you want and to the center block which is i don't know i think it's that one so that's the center block and we're going to leave on the wood again an 18 block gap so bit, uh, count back to the 19th so that's the first and I'll count back using the, the world edits. That's 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. And on the 19th block, we build again. So we'll put a shed here. So it's centre block. And the shed is nine wide. So it's four other sides. So one, two, three, four that way. One, two, three, four that way. So there's your front wall. And then the sides are five. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And then the back wall so and then you just build it two blocks high so it's, it's a basic shed really like so and then for the roof you can either use wood blocks or quartz slabs depending how much room you want inside so I think what I do I'll get uh, quartz slabs and uh, we'll do the top over so you've got room to get inside I've, on the prototype it's actually just a two block high building with a, with a wood roof but uh, this one I'll, I'll add a bit of space inside, so just use quartz. Oh damn it, quartz slabs to, for the roof. And there we go. There's our shed. <coughs> so in case you haven't guessed as well, the gap between uh, that was well, the large gap between each deck house is where the funnels go. So there's a funnel over there and a funnel over here. But we'll get to them another day. Uh, but anyway, that's the shed done. So what we're going to do now is leave. Uh, an 11, hang on, just bear with me on this one, uh, go to the back wall of of the uh, shed, and I'm just trying to read my notes, I think it's an, ele an 11 block gap back, so it's 11 back, 2 out, yeah, there's, there's two skylights to add now, these two are a little pain in the ass. so we've got the centre block, I'm going to go to the 11th block back, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and then 2 out, 1, 2, we build there, and then the same the other side, we go one, two, out, and build there. So you got, hang on, there we are. So you got the centre block there, and then you go out one, two blocks out to the side to put corner blocks. Now these are where the skylights are. Now these skylights are uh, three wide, so build them three wide, so like so. You got two walls like that, and then the sides are five. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Like so. And see on the other side. Like so. so you've got two basically double zero. And then build it three high. So build it two blocks high with blocks. I think that's how it goes. So build it two blocks high with blocks. And then on the sides uh, we use quartz stairs. I'm just trying to remember how I've done this because on the prototype it's a bit awkward, but we'll use stairs around the edge, uh, like so. And then, if you want to, you can use stairs on the front and the back corners as well, or the back front and back sides like that. So you've got basically a shape like that, and then use stairs on the other one as well. Like so, two deck, uh, two skylights basically, and then we add glass for the roof across like so and across like so and there we are there's two skylights like that not very well explained but they're there nonetheless uh, so they're basically three blocks high two blocks high plus stairs on top so yeah three blocks high so I'm just going to change the page on my notes so I know what I'm doing next and then we can move on so bear with me um, <clears throat> so what we want now is another four gap so this is a large skylight, so from the centre block between the two, so we want a four block gap, so one, two, three, four. And on the fifth block, we build a large skylight. Now, just see how this works. This is uh, nine wide, so that's uh, four either side, so one, two, three, four that way, one, two, three, four that way. And the sides are 14, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, fourteen. 
same the other side 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 join them together across the back so there's your foundations 9 wide 14 sides and this is 3 blocks high so I build it 2 blocks high all the way around with blocks and then we can use court stairs again to build it up so I'm trying to remember how I've done this uh, so we just build it two blocks high for the minute and I'm going to pop over to the, well you can see it's two blocks high around and I'm going to pop over to the prototype here because I've written this down but I've not written it down very well so that I can read it so I'm going to pop over and where are we? there so it's two blocks high, no, actually it's one block high with quartz stairs damn it, didn't work out very well right so we need to make it one block high and then we use stairs and slabs and glassy bits Okay, right, so that's screwed that over. So we need to reduce it down by another block. And uh, I knew I was going to screw it up somewhere. <coughs> so, like I said, we reduce it down by one block. So we remove said blocks down by one. Like so. And like I said, it should be three high. So we'll start at the edge. We'll start on the back wall here. So put stairs, block, and stairs and same on the other side so stairs block and stairs and then we just build a back wall like so like that and then every sort of second block so I leave a gap and do the same again so stairs block and stairs stairs block and stairs and then block all the way across like so, and we build a spine actually, we'll go and build a spine right through the middle right up to the uh, up to the back end, so you stairs, stairs there stairs, stairs there <clears throat> and like I say, you just boost stairs every other block along like so, so you've got a gap between each block and then we can put stairs in between, and yeah, stairs on top as well. So I put a, we'll go from the spine, put ribs across, going to each uh, stair block. Like so, it should look something like that. And I did the same the other side, so it's two blocks, block, 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 and block, and then stairs, 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 and stairs. And if you want to, you can remove the su supporting blocks underneath as well. It's up to you. I shall do that. And then we use quartz slabs to go in between the stairs. So quartz slabs in between. Like so. And then next block up as well, we'll put stair slabs as well. So on the bottom of the, of the second stair block up. So you've got slabs sort of like that. So it should look something like that. In theory, anyway. So do the same on the other side. Slab, 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 and slab, and then slabs a bit higher up. And there we go. There's the slabs in place, and our skylight don't look too bad. Kind of looks like a dead, a dead whale at the moment, but you know. And then we just put glass in the top, top ribs at the top here, like so. That's the theory, anyway. I mean, there's no guarantee it will work like this. There we go, there's a the skylight done. I'm sorry that took so long, it's just me screwing it up along the way, but that is how it should look anyway, so it uh, don't look too bad in theory. Alright, anyway, from the back wall of that uh, skylight, we're going to add two small skylights. More skylights, wonderful. So, a three block gap, so one, two, three. Uh. Pardon me. And then uh, two out to the side. Put a block, two out to the side the other way, add a block. And these skylights are four wide, sides are two. So one, two, three, four, and two for the sides. So two, three, four out, two sides, and like so. So you've got two zeros like that. And these are two blocks high, so uh, we use quartz stairs again for these. So I've got to put stairs all the way around. So, and the same on the other one. And there we go, that's the stairs added, and then we'll just add the glass, like so. 
and there we go there's the uh, skylights added there so that's all the deck houses pretty much done uh, there will be some more detail to add on this boat deck of course I mean, we've got vents and other things like uh, all, all sorts of things I don't know what they are but got loads of bits to add but uh, and lifeboats as well of course and funnels but uh, that's the main gist of how things are meant to be laid out so that's the top superstructure sort of done so we're going to leave it at that and I'm going to move on to something else so we're going to move on to the forecastle deck now on the uh, bow of the ship but before I do that I have a quick look over the top of the ship so you can get an idea on how things are meant to be laid out so you know, I've got a rough idea and uh, it don't look too bad in theory anyway but uh, you know things can change but anyway that's the top superstructure done for the moment so we're going to move on to the forecastle deck so what I'm going to do I'm going to do a quick jump cut while I work out what things go where and then we can move on to that so um, back in a moment okay back again so what we're going to do now is move on to the forward section of the ship so we've got the forecastle here which is this raised deck here and we're going to move on to this section here as well so uh, the forecastle deck will be done in a second, but we're going to work on this area here. So we're going to add two staircases first. So we're going to go to the front wall, which is this panel here. And to the side, this section here, we're going to remove a couple of blocks. So we're going to remove, say, two white blocks down and replace with stairs, stairs, and then a white block and stairs, a white block, and then some more stairs there. So we've got a staircase going down, and then the banisters, of course, two up, two up two up and then two up two up like so, so you've got a staircase on the end like so we do the same the other side so it's two staircases so remove two white blocks that and that replace with stairs stairs a white block with stairs and a white block with stairs like so and then the banisters of course two up two up two up <gasps> two up and two up like so so there we are there's our two staircases going down to the forward end of the ship and now we're going to add a cargo hatch so we're going to go back to the center block of this front wall and we're going to go uh, we'll leave a two block gap so two block gap and then we build our hatch which is uh, nine wide so that's four either side so one two three four that way one two three four that way and the sides are seven so one two three four five six seven one two three four five six seven and then across the back or the front whichever way you want that like that and then the roof of the cargo hatch we shall use slabs I think so we'll get our quartz slabs and we'll go so I think actually how do we do this we're going to, along the center actually we'll put a line of white blocks like so and then either side say two blocks of slabs like so so center is a single block and then either side two two slabs so I we'll use the two slabs across or going to the back like so and then the gap in between we just fill up with white blocks and there we go there's our cargo hatch it's sort of a, a flat pyramid if you like sort of shaped like that so that's the area done here so next job we want to do is go up now to the forecastle and this square here where the mast will go we're going to put the mast we're not going to build the mast but we're just going to build the foundation so one two three forward on the wood is where the mast will go so I'll put the first few blocks in place and that's where the mast will go right so what we're going to do now is work out what to do next so we're going to leave a single block gap from that uh, pardon me uh, I think it's a one block gap let me just read this so add the mass base and then we add a one block gap so a one block gap we build a shed which is five wide so one two three four five basically build it on the front white like so five wide and the sides are three one two three one two three and across the back and this is just two blocks high so it's, it's basically a white box really and then fill in like so and there's your shed slash box and then uh, leave a two block gap in front of that and we're going to build a nine nine block square a flat block a flat square basically so it's three wide three wide again and three wide again and that's it that's just a nine square block like so um, and then we're going to leave a you know, leave a five block gap after that so one two three four five and on the sixth block 
we build our breakwater which is three wide and two blocks high like so so it's basically a wall looks like three wide two blocks high and then you're going to build diagonally in singles going to the outside edge so from the each corner each corner or the, the back corner just build diagonally back like so and the first six are two blocks high so one two three four five six are two blocks high and the rest are one block high so do the same the other side diagonally backwards like so and the first six are two blocks high so one two three four five six like so so there's the break water like that I've got a feeling I may have done this a bit wrong but uh, no, no, don't look too bad actually. So just sort of look, looking at it from a distance, it's just saying that the breakwater is a bit too far back, but maybe it's not. Maybe it is in the right place. I'm just going to go over and have a look. Um, yeah, I think that's fine. It's just from the distance, it looks a bit weird, but yeah, it's okay. Anyway, that's the breakwater in place. And what we're going to do now is leave uh, some more blocks. I'm just going to leave another gap. We're just going to work out what to do. So we've got the. Uh, like that and what we're going to do now is in front of the breakwater we're going to need anvils so we'll get our anvils which are in there and we're going to put three anvils in front of the breakwater like so, so these are sort of represent bollards so got three in front there like that and then we're going to leave an eight block gap so one two three four five six seven eight and on the ninth block we build a flat yellow cross so you've got a yellow cross on the deck like so and you're going to build that two blocks high like that and then either side of that you're going to build in black upside down T so build a bottom of the T like that and then build it two or three high like that so a, it's basically an upside down T so one there and then one on the other side like so, so you've got a single block gap either side and an upside down T either side of that don't ask me I'm just sort of uh, represent oh, copying from models and photographs and these are the best designs I could come up for the said structures because uh, Minecraft does not have intricate details so we have T's um, and then from the T you're going to want to go diagonally back so from the uh, back end of the T you're going to go diagonally back two so one two and then we're going to build our vents which are I think there's a three high so one two three and a stairs on the top and a block on the front so like that so you've got a vent shaped like that I do the same the other side from the other T so one two back and we go one two three high plus stairs plus a block on the front like so and it should look something like that that's the theory anyway and then what we're going to do then is add the crane and we're going to go from the cross we're going to go seven forward so seven block gap one two three four five six seven and on the eighth block we build our crane which is seven high no four high sorry so one two three four like so so it's four high and it does look a bit far forward but uh, that's what's gonna do and then one block down from the or half a block down from the top we're gonna build the arm which is five so one two three four five five and then we build the body of the crane going down so half slabs going down like so then we are there's the crane added there nothing really special but you know it's it's a thing nonetheless and I think that's pretty much it for the uh, main details so the rest of the time we just want to add anvils before we do that though uh, we're gonna go uh, with on the inside of the uh, decking of the forecastle and we're gonna remove wood blocks in the corner so each white block is connected so you can see it sort of goes white blocks and then a, a wood block in the gap here so remove them replace them with white the reason for that is is when we add the handrails which we'll do in a bit the handrails will sit on the top of each block instead of going across wood blocks like so so remove the few wood blocks that we don't need in the corners and we'll replace them with white blocks and it should all look fine when it's all nice and neat so there we are there's the white blocks all replaced there I do the same the other side so white block white block white block etc etc so these ones are already done and then there we go 
there's the uh, white blocks all added there so what we're going to do is add a few anvils now these represent represent bollards so I put a couple on the side of the mass on the side of the crane sorry and then another couple just in front of the breakwater so a couple there and then another couple down on the well deck down here so down on the black section there like so so we've got sort of three pairs of bollards there and I do the same the other side so I put a pair there and then the other pair on the side of the of the breakwater and then the last pair down here on the uh, black section down there like that and there we go <coughs> that's that section there and I think that's pretty much it there's one more little job to do two more vents to add and these go either side of the shed on the front so just in front of the mast you got this shed and then we go one two three out to the side and we just add one two three up plus our stairs I've lost them now so I need them back court stairs and then a block on the front like so so it's three out to the side again we'll do the same again so one two three hang on one two three one two three up plus stairs plus another block there and there we go there's the folks all uh, vents done there and I think that's pretty much it for the folks there's not a huge amount of detail to add here but I think we can come back later on and add a bit more if we want to I mean we've still got the, the mast to go on and the, and the derricks and the, the parts of the mast to go on so and maybe big events as well but we'll see but anyway we're going to focus now on the uh, handrails so we're going to go back to the front end and just add handrails around the edge of the forecastle and that should uh, seal the deal there and that'll be all done so around to the back end and around to the stairs so the back when nearly done and then around to the other side I say it's not not a overly taxing job but when it's all done it does look quite good at least in my opinion anyway don't care what anyone else thinks and there we go there's the folks all done and they don't look too bad I mean from a distance it looks fine I mean close up it does look a bit sort of blocky and uh, well it's going to be blocky in it because it's Minecraft but you know don't look too bad and uh, yeah that's that so um before we move on, I'm just going to point out again, if you're building this as part of a video or a downloadable project, then of course don't forget to leave credit for the design. I have seen videos pop up this week of my uh, Lusitania and Britannic, which is not nice. I think a Vietnamese person done it, or a, sort of that part of the world, Thai, whatever. Anyway, that's that. So what we're going to do is leave it there and then, and we'll call it a day. So that's it for part four. Part five we'll do probably the stern deck details, I mean we've got docking bridge, cranes, cargo hatches and things over there so those things will be uh, the main focus for part 5 maybe the funnels, maybe the lifeboats, maybe the masts, I don't know but uh, <coughs> still plenty to go on but you know we'll see when we get there and um, I think we'll leave it at that so this is Rich signing off, logging off, disappearing and I shall return in part 5 so uh, bye for now <laughs>